Hello, baby. Hey, how you doing? Wait up. You are so beautiful, you know that? You know what? When I prayed this morning, I asked God for an angel. And lo and behold, you are here, walking right beside me. Come on, baby, say something. Don't ignore me, okay? I'm dying here. Why don't you just save your breath, okay? Because you see this right here, and married. Oh, you're married. Uh, I see. I'm not gonna fall for that, okay? Hey, let me tell you something. It's just a poorly employed by women to drive away guys from cutting them off. So you see, I know, all right? Come on, say something, my love. Say something, baby. Okay, anybody can I buy a ring. Married, married, married. Leave me alone. Well, lie, lie, lie. I won't fall for that. Come on, you know you're lying. Anybody can buy a ring and just fly the ring and say, I'm married. So look, I know what I'm saying. I know you like me. Come on, look at that. Oh my God. You look so beautiful. Look, baby, you and I, the destiny, the fate. I love you, I'm dying. Oh dear. Hey, baby. Hey, wait a I'm talking to you for Christ's sake. Hey, baby, come on, wait up. Why are you running away from me? Speed, my angel, why are you running? Hey, come on, listen to me for Christ's sake. Hey, listen. Look, you are my angel. I have found my angel in this house. My angel in this compound. I have found my angel in you. So please, baby, just call this place and come on and <laughs> What's the meaning of this? You are toasting my wife right to my doorstep. She's your wife? No, she's your wife. Hey, come on, man. It's, it's all right. Just hold on. Hold on. Let me call her. And it's easy, all right? We're cool here. Hold on. Man. Hey, come on. It's all right, man. like a single girl attracting all kinds of men to you and you must minimize your makeup it's too loud it gives the impression that you you know you are single and available for them well Street, I think you you're, you're right since all these men have actually gone crazy it's not good to really Give them the green light. Mm. I'm happy you see my point. Of course I see it. It's not me, everything is happening to. I mean, yesterday, a man followed me home. Oh, what about two days ago, the one I told you about? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, men are just so crazy. God. You see the point. I don't even believe I'm married. This is where my head finds rest and my dreams are sweet. <laughs> my husband, mm. you know you have to sleep early, okay? Mm. You have an early appointment with the oil company tomorrow. Mm. And like a good wife that I am, I will pray for you. I will pray that God will grant you success and that if you go, the contract will be yours, so you can supply the oil company safety goods. I mean, we've tried, really. It's time to upgrade. Yeah. Well, whether they're big contracts or small contracts, we thank God for all the blessings. Yeah, we do. Yeah. That's why I bought those three taxes we have on the road so that 
whether the contracts come or not, we still have money to eat and pay our daily bills. <laughs> a husband with a foresight. Okay. I'm rather just happy that I have you. We're lucky to have us. <laughs> yes, we are lucky to have us. What do you think you're doing? Oh, sweetheart, I'm making up. Going out. Are you already dressed to go out? Or you're just playing with your makeup just to see how you looked yesterday? Um, I'm just trying to put strange touches my makeup so I can... Oh! Sweetheart, is that what we talked about yesterday? Look, I had a weird thing when I was having my bath today. And I'd say that I'm not going to look shabby just because men are attracted to me and the way I dress and my beauty. No. Look, you don't have to worry about anything. I'm not going to go naked. I'm just going to look beautiful. And that's it. Wait a minute. Are you, in other words, saying that you are going to disobey me? Because you know that I will not take. I will not dance to your tune. Baby, what has dancing to your tune got to do with this now? What has it got to do with this? All I'm saying is that I am not going to look shabby like you want me to look when I'm going out like a village wife. I won't. I've thought about it carefully and it's not working for me. I would not do that. All right. That means that the end of peace in this marriage has come. I will not take it because you cannot have two captains in one ship. Peace for me in this family simply because of my mood of dressing. You're Look at me, Chica. I am not naked. I am dressed well. Your okay. disobedience is the beginning of the end of peace in this house. Okay, fine. Let it be the end of peace in this house. What is it, self? Let Chica Wala be this one. What is it? Because I do not want to dress like someone who's been maltreated in her marriage and her home. Because I want to shine and look beautiful. You raise your voice. Temptation comes with many beautiful things The devil takes more than he really gives He will promise you power He will promise to give you joy But the devil only comes to kill and destroy So run don't take from the devil. Run. Don't give to the devil. Run. No matter what you give or take, there is no gain. No gain. No gain. No gain. No gain. He will promise you pleasure only to give you pain. If you sell your soul hey, to hey, the hey. devil. Hey! Come here. Where do you think you're going to? To the market, of course. And after that, I would go to the taxi driver park so I can take our weekly money. And you have to dress like this? Eh? Did we not quarrel just last week that we quarreled about this kind of dressing? Last month, three months ago, is there no week that we do not quarrel at least twice because of this kind of dressing? Yes. And that is because you have changed from the loving husband I used to know into, into this. Insecure, jealous, and the most possessive man I've ever known on earth. And that is also because you encourage men to run after you because of your kind of dressing. Huh? Oh, oh, I'm sure you enjoy it when they stop you on the streets and say, Hello, baby. Hello, fine girl. Can I give you a lift? Hello, sweetie. That's the kind of thing you want. Huh? Go inside and change those clothes. Quickly. I'm not going to change this dress today. 
Has it come to that? The worst part of it is that you, you caused me so much embarrassment on the streets now. Somebody stopped me the other day and was asking me, are you never at home when your wife dresses to go out like this? Is this how you want your wife to dress? That, what kind of questions are those? And I suppose you slapped the person? I... Because the man needed a slap. No, I didn't slap him. I walked away from him shame-faced. Because it is you that I am going to slap if you don't go in now and change those clothes. Mm. Yes. Okay. You can say up and you can say down. But today, this is how I choose to dress. Come here. Go, go inside and change. I said, go inside and change. Temptation comes with many beautiful things. The devil takes more than he really gives. He will promise you power. He will promise to give you joy. But the devil only comes to kill and destroy. So run. Don't take from the devil. Run. Don't give to the devil. Run. No matter what you give or take, there is no gain. No game. No game. Uh-uh. Eh? Sorry, sorry, my dad. What do you mean by sorry? Don't you have eyes to see? Sorry. Uh, don't shout now. I'm picking them up as you can see. Look, this is not a picking matter. Let me just tell you. It is a pain matter. You hear me? My tomatoes have touched sand. Don't worry, madam. I will wash them. I will wash them. I will buy pure water and wash them. Wash what? I will buy pure water and wash them. Hey! No trouble. Look, sand has entered the eyes of all my tomatoes. Tell me if your girlfriend should cook with this kind of tomatoes for you when you have to chew and swallow sand. Will you be happy? Look, tell me my tomatoes so that police will not have to settle this matter. I'm telling you. You hear me? And this tomatoes is what? 4,000 naira. Eh? Uh, 4,000 for these tomatoes? The tomatoes here is not even worth 300 naira, 4,000. Uh -huh. what, what, what kind of a liar are you? Hey! Not only have you thrown away my tomatoes, you are calling me a liar. Come here! Come and pay for my tomatoes. No, no, Look for this yeah. rubbish you have done, I'm telling you. No this tomatoes this is now worth 5,000 naira. Uh -huh. Pay me or police will hear. Uh -huh. I'm telling you. From 4,000 now, 5,000. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what is funny? You think this matter is funny? No, no, no. I'm just looking at your face. Look at a fine girl like you. See how you are quarreling with me. Ah, uh -uh. me a girl. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Uh, what do you think you are before? A I'm man. A uh, no, I mean, uh, I know I'm a woman, but uh -uh. like a girl. Fine girl like you say you are a woman. <laughs> oh, fine girl. Hey, look at how old are you? <laughs> Actually, I'm 25 years. That's a lie. You 25? Uh, when I was thinking that you are just about 19, at most 21. <laughs> yeah. That means I look younger than my age. You're very much younger. <laughs> I'm even thinking, wishing that I could take you to my house now. Eh. 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 Okay, now. Um, um, now here they sell tomato so. I mean, uh, hey. uh, my name is Bernice. Bernice, mm. you see? Fine girl, <laughs> fine name. <laughs> hey. okay. um, tomorrow afternoon, eh, I will come with a taxi to take you to my house. Are they here? It's your house, far? No. No, you see that? Just by the bend there. Okay. Tomorrow, eh? okay. 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 Uh, okay. Sell well, eh? <laughs> bye bye. bye. <laughs> so, 
I th you believe me when I said you are just 19 years, eh? Yes. You are just a grand old mother. Me? Hide! Temptation comes with many beautiful things. The devil takes more than he really gives. He will promise you power. He will promise to give you joy. But the devil only so I follow you every day. Struggling to get out of the trouble that you put me in. Eh? God calling, God calling old women, young women. Calling very ugly women, beautiful women. Just because I want to follow you and make sure that you don't talk to any man. Or that any man doesn't talk to you. <laughs> what kind of nonsense is that? <laughs> but is it a crime to marry a beautiful woman? Eh? Is it a crime? Ah, ah. Sometimes I even wonder, the, 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 Madonna's husband, how did she cope? Or oh, that one they call uh, Mary Lane Monroe. No, that one didn't even have any husband. Eh? Marry a fine woman, you're in trouble. Wahala. Ah, and she will not even wear things that will make her look uh, 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 good. Why do you enjoy punishing me? Eh? Every day you dress beautifully like this. You go out there, I'll be here thinking that some man out there will chase you. I've told you that it bothers me. You will not listen. How many times do you want me to say it? Chicken, are we going to talk about this till we grow old? Are we? Am I God that made me a beautiful woman? No. Did you want to go to God and ask him to recreate me? Yes, go to him. Go to him and ask me to change my beauty. After it was not the beauty that attracted you in the first place. You can go about the village, pointing out all the men's eyes in this small town so they will not see my beauty and follow me. Like I, it's my fault that I'm beautiful. Look, I have told you, each time you are going out, tie a wrapper. Take a Bible, put it under your arm. So that anybody who sees you will know that you are a responsible married woman. You will not listen. You go about the streets, you, you, you smile, open your teeth very wide, greeting all the men that you see. Eh? Eh? eh. Good morning, Peter. Eh, good morning, Paul. You will open Why? your teeth. Don't talk when I'm talking. Look, one day, you will come back here to find that I have a high BP. And then I will die suddenly so that all the men can come in their 20s and 30s to marry you at the same time. Fine girl. Chike, why are you bothered about me? I'm fine. Okay, did you see all the ugly ones before you came for me, the fine one, to get married to? Of course you saw them. Look, Chike, what, what you're doing is really becoming very annoying and it is called insecurity. And insecurity is the beginning of the downfall of anything. The downfall of what? No, say it. Go, go ahead. Insecurity is the, is the beginning of the downfall of what? Of me. Chicken, eh? I was trying to say that insecurity is the beginning of the downfall of anything. Shut anybody. up. I know what you want to say. I know you very well. You were going to say that insecurity is the downfall of me. No! Chica, I didn't say that. All I said is... Look. Chicken, it is a lie. What is lying? I'm not saying... I didn't see you. Who's lying? Eh? Insecurity is the downfall of me. I swear to God, Chike. You have to better stop this, okay? You have to better stop this. You hit me at the front. Look, stop it. What's the meaning of this? The meaning of that? You, this is the meaning of that. You run, eh? Come back here to me. Come back here to me. Fine get but I will I will soak clot in water and wipe off all that lipstick and pancake. Okay, you will come back. 
All those fine jeans trousers, I will cut them out. To kill and destroy. So run. Don't take from the devil. Run. Don't give to the devil. Run. No matter one what by you one, give or take, there is no game. No no game. No game. No How can another man see the shape of my wife's buttocks? What? 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 My wife's buttocks. You better wrap it up. Go naked. Go naked. Even the wrapper, once it is too tight around your waist, finish. I will cut all of them. I will buy you maxi skirt. Maxi skirt. That's what a woman should wear. Even that one, if you abuse it, you will wear sackcloth. There is no gain. Look at it. Look, look, look at this one. Look. At it. Is this not the one they wear? They, they call low waist that they wear to nightclub. Look at my wife. Eh? In my house, there will be no low waist in this house. You will not wear. The devil takes more than you will not wear. No low waist. You just might wear magic. But the devil only comes to kill and destroy. So you will not wear any no waste in my life. There's nothing like this. Don't give to the devil waste. No matter what you do, you won't wear magic. There is no game. No game. No game. No game. He will promise you pleasure only to give you pain. If you sell your soul to the devil for power and gold, one day you discover that there is no gain, no gain, no gain, no gain. Hello. Hi. Hi. You are not mistaken. You must be the wife to a young man whom I consider to be the most good-looking man. And who is this good looking man you're talking about? I don't know his name exactly, but I can describe him. Go ahead. Um, he's not too tall, he's not slim, he's not light skinned, but he's not in his early 20s. But he's certainly a face you will remember when you want to remember faces of good looking men around. If by any chance you're talking about the most insecure, jealous, and possessive man on earth, yes, you have him, my husband. You sound really angry. You don't like him that much, do you? Well, you see, the good-looking man just hit me, and I hate it whenever he does that. Whenever he hits me, I hate him so much. You shouldn't say that to me. I'm a total stranger, you know. Well, I said it already. I don't care if he hears it. It is none of my business. What's the worst he can do to me anyway? Hit me again. Goodness, you sound really angry. If you were in my shoes, wouldn't you be? If the person who hits you is the one person that you love so much in the entire world, and that you know that you can never ever hurt him, even in your wildest, craziest dreams. Anyway, the name's Ruby. What's yours? Now, no. Or you can call me Zizi. It's my pet name. He used to call me now, but ever since we moved down here, he called me Zizi. Because he says that whenever I sleep, I just <laughs> Everybody calls me Zizi, so you can call me Zizi. It's fine. All right, come on, Zizi. Let's go to my house. I live just around the corner. Um, I live alone. I don't have a husband yet. But that's because I don't want a husband. I can give you a cold drink to quench your mood and then we could be friends and foot. What do you say? I say, how could you invite me over to your house? You don't even know me. Well, it doesn't take forever to know who you want to be friends with when you meet them, does it? No, it doesn't. But still, a little knowing matters. But hey, look, I could really do a very good friend right now. Oh, exactly. So, come on, let's go. 
Look at you, you're a piece of beauty yourself. You're beautiful too. I wonder if I can this way. And if you replace them, I'm going to cut it to pieces. We came to this town to make money. You hear me? Not to paint red lips and shining faces without shame. It's not even spare one for me. Yes, because even in the Bible, God said to Saul, King of Israel, go to the kingdom of Agag, destroy everything, kill even King Agag. But Saul went there and spared all the fat cow and the fat sheep and even spared King Agag. God was very angry. And when God asked him, Saul said, I spared these ones because I want to sacrifice them to you. You know what God told him? It is better to obey than to sacrifice. Meaning, Meaning that I did not spare anyone because one can lead you to derail from this marriage. Meaning that sometimes we have to destroy the beautiful things we have so that we can stay focused on what we want to be. Meaning that, Chiki, you are talking rubbish. Me, talking yes. rubbish. Absolute rubbish. Eh? And you know it. I'm but talking rubbish. Yes, you're talking rubbish. What is the worst thing you can do to me? Slap me again? Hit me, Chiki. Hit me if you're not unconscious. Though I take our domestic problems to third party, you'll be mad at me. I don't want that. I was already mad at you now for doing nothing. Isn't it better you do something wrong for a change? And if that thing you're doing wrong is talking to someone who's not afraid of him and can talk sense into him, then why not? Zizi. I want to go and talk to your husband. You can wait here while I go and come back. Okay. It's alright. We can go. But please, don't tell him everything in details. Please. Don't worry. Okay? Everything will be fine. Right? Temptation comes with many beautiful things. The devil takes more than he really gives. He will promise you power, he will promise to give you joy But the devil only comes to kill and destroy So run, don't take from the devil Run, don't give to the devil Run, no matter what you give or take There is no gain, no gain, no gain, no gain. Oh hi, uh, my name is Ruby, I'm your neighbor My neighbor? this compound? Um, no, I'm actually living in this town. I'm your neighbor in this town. And I'm your wife's friend. She's not at home. And for your information, she's not allowed to receive visitors anymore. I see you are the one spoiling her. You're the one who teaches her to wear this boys follow me clothes all over the place. Eh? 
You know, actually, that is one of the reasons why I'm here. Um, I need to talk to you. Can I come in? Come in? Come in where? You say what you want to say from there. Okay. Um, I need to talk to you about your wife. She's not a happy woman. She complains of how you hit her and you slap her all the time. For Christ's sakes, a woman's life is delicate. And it needs a lot of pampering. That's what she told you, eh? She took our domestic problems and came out to tell the whole world. Eh? And you are in support of that. This is the look, this is the height of it. This is the height of it. Why are you screaming at me? Can you treat me with a little respect at least? I'm only trying to help you here. Respect. You respect. Get out from here. I said get out from here. You didn't hear. the way he pushed me like I was a man like him with so much strength. My dear, I don't have to be there. I know this man. I know what he is capable of doing. Ruby, I'm, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to put you through this, please. I'm sorry. Uh, this is the reason why I did not want you to get involved in the first place. I know who this man is. I know him inside out. Honestly, my friend, I don't know how you can keep standing in for this nonsense. But there's something I can give to you to swallow. <laughs> Overnight, all this nonsense. What is it to be this appeal? See, it is called Faith, Fear, Faith. I have it in this house with me. And I took it years ago, and that is why I can talk to any man, and anything I say, he doesn't. God forbid. Juju, look, I would never be involved in anything like that. God, but what is wrong with it? It is protection. It's not like you're killing anybody. <laughs> Ruby, I'll, I'll just take my leave, okay? I'm sure that by the time I come back and see you, all this evil talk will have cleared your head. I pray. Just sit down, sit down. Ah, I was just joking with you. I just wanted to see how you do that. Sit down, guys. God, you scared me, really. Wait, I do not want to ever have anything to do with you. In this my life. I am so content with the way I am. I told my sister, she do no good at all. At all. It's me. Go back to where you're coming from. Please open the door for me. Please. Don't do this. I said go back to where you're coming from. No, look, just stay there. You will sleep just by the door there. That's your punishment. If you go back to anywhere to sleep, you will see what I will do to you. Baby, please just open the door for me. How do you expect me to sleep outside? How do I expect you to sleep outside? I've not done anything wrong to you. You will sleep by the door there, then you will know exactly how to sleep outside. Look, what you're doing is not helping us at all, oh. It's not helping us at all. I said... You 
you stay out all day and then you just sleep there. That's your punishment. You're just this. Things the devil takes more than he really gives. Swallow this, break it. Drink all of it. I thought you said it was a joke. As you can see, this is no joke. Swallow this, and that man will never hit you again. Let me go pick us something to eat. Temptation comes with many beautiful things. The devil takes more than he really gives. He will promise you power. He will promise to give you joy But the devil only comes To kill and destroy So Run Don't take from the devil Run Don't give to the devil Run No matter what you give or take There is no gain No gain No gain No gain, no gain. No gain. He will promise you pleasure Only to give you pain if you sell your soul to the devil for power and gold One day you'll discover that There is no gain No gain No gain No gain, no gain. No gain. He will promise you pleasure Only to give you pain If you sell your soul to the devil for power and gold One day you'll discover that There is no gain do you think you can do whatever you like in this house? Eh? Where are you coming from? My friend's house. Is that where you slept? Yes. Temptation comes with many beautiful things The devil takes more than he really gives He will promise you power He will promise to give you joy But the devil only comes to kill and destroy <laughs> Which came? This never happened before. Turn my body like this. Ah, ah. Ah. Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! 
God, this is witchcraft, though. How many do you want? You stupid. You mad. Before we let by the whole tree and go and sell somewhere. Of course I want one. Choose the one you want. This one is bad. I beg you, don't don't put that bread in your mouth. Meaning? It's no good. People are still going to buy this bread. And if any of my customers see you smelling them, they will not buy from me again. So, is that the way they taught you to talk to your elders? Don't you know I am older than you? I know you are older than me, but it's my bread. I can tell you what you are doing to my bread that I don't like. Oh, you shut up! Don't you ever talk to me like that again, do you understand me? Don't ever try it! Because I'm buying bread from you. Are you, are you mad? In fact, take your bread. Get out. I will not buy again. Is it because I'm more beautiful than you are? Somebody else will treat you like this. Let the evil flog you. You are cursing me. Someday you'll be a mother. Hey. Okay. Let me show you what someone's mother can do to you. Last night. Are you not the same girl that insulted me yesterday? You have come back to insult me today again, complete the insult. You said evil spirit will flog me. Then you flogged me in my dream last night. Now look at my body. It's as if somebody flogged me in the real life. <laughs> You're a witch. Temptation comes with many beautiful things. <laughs> the devil takes. So there's still jean straws that to be worn in this house. I don't know. Then you will want my surprise. As long as it is for the big husband, everything is fine, everything is okay. But as long as it's for me, the small wife. No, no, everything is not okay. It has to be bad. For your information. Trousers were created for men and skirts for women. 
I don't understand why women would prefer what was created for men. I can see that when God was creating this world, creating man and woman, he invited you especially to come and be a judge over it. He showed you the dress that is for man and showed you the one that is for woman. I can see that. Bad mouth. It won't get you anywhere. Bad mouth. Foul mouth. Possessiveness. Jealousy. Not wanting your wife to look fine. It will not get you anywhere. Just to, to all my all my beauty my beautiful dress. You think I would not get angry? And you still have your own jeans, so say you take it out, you look good. So only me is good to look bad. How do I look? Don't look for my trouble. Well, she you are going out. She you are, you are going out now. You are going out. You said you told my jeans chosen because he attracts men to me. No problem. It's okay. But someday, when your jeans begin to attract people to you, someone will tear it. for the love that we used to share that was so so sweet now everything is so so bad because of your unreasonable jealousy chick Tomatoes they come from our salon, and this our salon people recently they don't put price. So I don't know what happened for their money. Look at my bed, wait, look at my tomatoes. Hey, God has caught you today. Who are you? What do you want? I say God has caught you today. What do I want? Where is the love that you promised me? Which love? You look, hey, look, look, sit hey. Leave. Ah. Hey, look, you will pay for my tomatoes today or you will stay with me as you say you would. You've not seen trouble though. Which uh -uh. tomatoes? Uh -uh. Please, you go back to your market and get your hands off me. Uh -huh. I am a real Babati woman. You've not seen trouble. Okay. Give me the love today. Get your hands off my clothes. Where, 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 where do I know you? Hey, uh -huh. You think I'm playing me while you like that? Uh -huh. Give me the love. Who is playing while you? Look, you are embarrassing me on the road. Uh -huh. you can... I have not started yet though. Remove you. Look, good for you. Get up. My hand. Oh. things I see things I sleep and I dream and my dream becomes reality Ruby, 
This is not me. I'm not normal. Ever since I took your egg, it's been like this for me. Ruby. Ruby. Who am I? Tell me. What am I? You have become a witch just like me. But it doesn't matter. You'll be strong like me. What do you have to lose? I knew it. I knew something was happening to me. This is not me. I'm someone else now. It's not me. This is not me. But Ruby, why did you do this to me? Why did you give me witchcraft to eat? Why? Run. Don't take it from the devil. Run. Don't give to the devil. Run. No matter what you give or take, there is no game. No game, no game, no game. No he will promise you pleasure, only to give you pain. If you sell your soul to the devil for power and gold, one day you'll discover that there is no game. Sleep, she's going to appear to me again. Look, I don't sense anything, really. Just I can sense her around. I can feel her. I can feel her presence here. to the taxi. You don't want to drive it anymore? Yes, sir. Yes, but you have not told me why. Why don't you want to drive it anymore? Sir, if I tell you now, you say it's that all. Boy, serious. And I'm serious about it. So what is it? Sir, for two nights now, I've been having this dream that I had an accident in that car. And I died. My body was taken to the hospital, sir. Uh, sir, I'm sorry. Sorry, sir. 
I know you say it's because of a mad dream that I'm resigning. But it's so real when I dreamt this dream. It's so real, sir. I've had this dream for two consecutive nights, sir. I don't want you to die. So, from now on, I will drive the car myself. Give me the key. Thank you. Temptation comes with many beautiful things. The devil. What is wrong with you? Why are you in this mood? I don't know what is happening to me. What do you mean? I don't know what's happening to me. But I'm a man. I'm a man. Where are you going to? I want to take the taxi out. I've got to make some money today. Why? What about the taxi driver? Temptation comes with many beautiful things. The devil takes more than he really gives. He will promise you power, he will promise to give you joy. But the devil only comes to kill and destroy. So run, don't take from the devil. Run, don't give to the devil. Run, no matter what you give or take, there is no gain. No game, no game, no game. Sorry, that driver. What is wrong with the car? to give you joy but the devil only comes to kill and destroy so run don't take from the devil run don't give to the devil run no matter what you give or take there is no gain that's all you no he will promise you pleasure only to give you pain if you sell your soul to the devil one day you discover that there is no gain, no gain, no gain, no gain, no gain. He will promise you pleasure only to give you pain. If you sell your soul to the devil for power and gold, one day you discover that there is no gain, no gain. Temptation comes with many beautiful things. Uh, my friend, is this car going to start or not? Hey, your guy, it, it will start. They just serviced it this morning. I think it caught fuel. I have an appointment too. 
I'm in a hurry. Hey, Oga. Please, just help me, eh? Yeah. Just help me to push her. Let, let me start it. Me? Push the car? Is that a joke or what? Eh? Please, give me the refund of my money so that I can go and take another taxi. I have to leave here now. I don't have any other money now. The money you paid me, I, I used it to buy foil. You were there when I bought foil. I said, give me money, make I buy foil. I don't have any other money. So, what is going to happen? About what? My money. Ha! Oh, I say I don't have any money. Now, you were there when I bought the foil. Do I go to bank if I come up? My friend, give me the balance of my 2,000 naira. Or you will face me now. Face me how? This yes. orange fight. I say I know. Okay, give me my money. Give ah, ah, my, give my check. Ah, you necklace. You, you necklace. Ah. You just a collar in a open eye. Which one? Oh, now your eye, tear, reach my own. It, your own tear. I say understand. Then what are you? Did you even pick up that guy from? Is he an animal or something? Now, if it was your fault that the car broke down, was it? Anyway, how did it go with the car? What did the mechanic say? I'm taking it to three mechanics. They don't seem to know what's wrong with it. But it's normal. <laughs> That's not possible. There's something actually wrong with the car. Are you even sure those mechanics even know their job? How now? How things now? What of uh, Director Indy? That contract where I tell you now, he's a make a break. I have been so. For your own good, eh? Leave. Just carry style now. Run for cow. You didn't hear me? Oga say make I tell police. Anytime I see you around. What did I do now? What is wrong? I don't know. Me, self, I no one know. Did they hear me? Oga, no one see your face again, even for a next generation. Did they hear me? Say the contract way too often a gate. You mess and down. No, no. 
regarder. No. Il chose un ami au garde des top. There must be a mix up here. Mix up. Go. You don't mix her up now. Go. Go. I say take style run for car. You know you're waiting at talk before. Oga. <laughs> oh. So this small work now what they do? They eat small salary. Make her take finish my higher institution. Now you won't make her lose. Make me and you know who go sleep for police. Eh? You see police, eh? Me and you go know who go sleep there. Wait, you know? Make her wait. Wait for you. You go sleep. Bros, I beg for your information. I can't see me to just go. I beg. If you dare to spoil our work for us, I beg. I can't go there happy to come see you around me. So I beg. I carry God me back. I beg. Just go. I beg. Temptation comes with many beautiful things The devil takes more than he really gives He will promise you power He will promise to give you joy But the devil only comes to kill and destroy So run, don't take from The other two drivers came back and said that they were not going to work again They said they have similar dreams with the other one but whenever they sleep, they dream of accidents. So they came back with the key. Oh, don't worry, it's okay. We won't break it. At least we have the contract to fall back on. There are no contracts. I was chased away from the gate of the oil company this morning. The director who has been like a father to me all this while suddenly doesn't want to see me anymore. I don't know what is happening to me. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm losing everything. I'm losing everything that I've built. Watching him cry kills me. Am I responsible for all those things that happened to him? Am I responsible for all the mishaps and the pains, the hurt that he's feeling? Ruby, if I am, then please, please, I beg of you, take this thing that you put inside of me away. He's my husband. And I love him so much. I don't want to hurt him. I don't. Please. Well, he was maltreating you. And you swallowed what was placed before you willingly. Nobody forced you to. That was only because I thought that whatever you gave to me was going to make him stop putting me. I'm bullying you anytime I dress up in trousers and I paint my face to go out. I think it was going to give me so much strength and power to hurt him. Look, don't be please. I love this man so much. I would rather have him beat me every single day of my life than watch him go through all these pains that he's going through. Please. Then if you choose to, then you lose him to me. What? Yes. Ruby, what's the meaning of all this? Do you have eyes for my husband? I did not. Until I got a relation from the COVID, then I sacrificed my room to get to where I am today. You see this house? The comfort? 
all the government contracts and even the power to make the strongest men look away from my eyes when I talk to them. I sacrifice my room for that. And I got a revelation that a certain man who will always beat his wife up for making up will be the only man that can shoot through my womb and get me pregnant. Let me tell you, my dear sister, your husband is a hot cake in the spiritual world. And he's in high demand. No, no, no. Ruby, you would not have him. Listen to me, Ruby. You cannot have my husband. He is my husband. You can't. As long as you both shall leave, you shall torment him. Day and night you shall torment him. Asleep and awake you shall torment him. Absent or present you shall torment him. You shall torment him so he's not able to afford one square meal a day. You shall torment him until he dies. Ruby, please, you can't do this to me. Forgive us. We have done nothing to you. I did not do anything to you. Are you? Why are you doing this to me? Please. <laughs> you do not wrong me. Ask your husband if he knows a certain tomato seller. That day, I was told to go on the road and hog tomatoes. And that a certain man will come my way. Playing tricks which he considered harmless. And because he thought he was smart. He could throw my tomatoes away and go away without paying for it. I was told the key to my pregnancy lies in that man's hand. I was that tomato seller. After changing, I'll hurry to where I park my car and drive home. And the next time, I become a tomato seller. And that was when he sent the cause of having his jean trousers turned. I went to carry out that cause. I tore his jeans. How did you know I cursed him? You were not there. Whatever you say flows in the air. The spirit here, the good spirits and the bad spirits. That is why it is always good to keep our good plans in silence and weigh whatever we say. Because once the bad spirits hear of the good plans you're making, they will always, always want to spoil it. Look, still I'm not going to let you have my husband, okay? I would not let you come into my life and take my husband just like that, no! <laughs> look, look, listen to me, Ruby. I was not there when you sold your womb to the devil for money and power. I wasn't there. I wasn't there when you did all the things that you were doing, okay? So why do you want my husband? Why? Why is it him?
this? What's this? What's this? Um, for how long have you had these symptoms? About 2 a.m. this morning. Uh, my heart skipped and I woke up. And I felt my body was hot all over, as if I had fire inside me. My legs shivered. Doctor, what's wrong with him? Well, um, nothing appears to be wrong with him. You see, all the tests we ran on him revealed nothing. His BP is normal. His blood sugar level is normal. His bilirubin is normal. His urine analysis is normal. So, he is medically fit. And why am I feeling so sick? Maybe you tried the teaching hospital for more tests. But I want to assure you something. All the tests we carried out are accurate. You are medically okay. Hmm? We're not going to any teaching hospital. They can't save you there. It won't be a waste of our time and our money. I know exactly what's wrong with you. And because of your problems, After I finish telling you the story, I would go over to her house. And it's either she takes away what she puts in me, or she will just kill me. She will just kill me. What are you talking about? A few weeks ago, when you're bullying and constant beating became very serious. I was by the roadside one of these days and this beautiful woman walked up to me. She talked to me nicely and she consoled me. And we became friends. Her name is Ruby. She took me to her house. It's streets away from here. Little did I know that she was a witch. And that she wanted you. She wanted me. For what? Because according to her, you're hot cake in their coven. And that you're the only man that can father her child. Mean to hurt you. I'm very sorry. And it's not mean to hurt you, but I just wanted it to stop beating me. Run! Don't take from the devil. Run! Don't give to the devil. Run! No matter what you give or take, there is no gain. No gain. No gain. No gain. No gain. No gain. He will promise you pleasure. 
only to give you pain. If you sell your soul to the devil for power and gold, one day you'll discover that there is no gain. Ruby! Ruby! You've come to do me harm. Are you out of your mind? Yes. Yes, I have been out of my mind. My goddamn mind. Right from the first day my husband had this misfortune because of me. Now there must be some sort of solution. Give it to me. Please give it to me. Give it to me. Do you honestly think you can harm me with that knife? Or have you forgotten who I am? Don't you still know who I am? Of course I know who you are. You are the cheap witch who prays on other people's husband to get pregnant. You sold your womb and your womanhood for money, fame, and all this? Of course I know who you are. Ruby, if this knife does not hurt you, then I'm not a witch. Now I'm not a witch. And it means that my mother did not teach me well when she said that a blunt kitchen knife can destroy even the highest of your kind. Give me the solution. Give it to me! Ruby, I'm, I'm talking to you, I'm serious! I thought you did dance. And I am still the better dancer. comes with many beautiful things the devil takes more than he really gives he will promise you power he will promise to give you joy but the devil only comes to kill and destroy so run don't take from the devil run don't give to the devil run no matter what you give or take there is no gain no no game, no game, no game. Zizi. Zizi. I've been looking for you everywhere. Huh? Come, let me take you home. Zizi. No bands kick Man, they chase you. Then it's horse but beats you. Come, and then come. I don't know. Come, I don't know. Okay. 
Fuck. Fuck. Fuck la. But the devil only comes. We have to get people to help us. Yes sir. Yes sir. Don't take from the devil. Don't give to the give to the devil. No matter what you give or take. We have to get people to help us. No game. No game. No game. No game. He will promise you pleasure. Only to give you pain. If you sell your soul to the devil for power and gold, one day you discover that there is no gain, no gain, no gain, no gain. No gain. He will promise you pleasure only to give you pain. If you sell your soul to the devil for power and gold, one day you discover that there is no gain. No game, no, no game. Temptation comes with many beautiful things. The devil takes more than he really gives. Well, I must he say, um, really, really shocked beyond words at your visit. Especially when I thought you were going to war pass and fight me. Because I know your wife confessed to you before coming here to fight me. So am I right? Did she? <laughs> um, <clears throat> yeah, yes, she did. She did. And um, as soon as she told me, I got interested immediately. But I would have been here before now. I didn't know how to locate your house. And she was around then, you know. But uh, I thank the spirits that she's gone now. So I can have you all to myself. <laughs> you know, I have never imagined that someone as beautiful as, as you would, would love me or want me. Oh well, now I see where you get the confidence to come to my house. So what do you want now? Mistress? Mistress? I want a wife. <laughs> I want a wife. I want to replace her. Huh? But if she could swallow an egg just to have control over my life, then I should forget her quickly. Wait. You want marriage? Yes. You want to marry me? Yes. Oh my god. Like, this is great. You know, this is even turning out much better than I even expected. You know what? You come live here with me. You move into my house. I'm sure this place will be comfortable for you. Yes, yes. <laughs> and as for Zizi, or now or whatever you call her. <laughs> well, I'm sure you forget her soon. When I show you what TLC is all about. TLC? Yeah. Tender, loving care. Oh. <laughs> TLC. <laughs> look, look. I am prepared to love you for as long as you want me. Trying to read my mind. Yes. And you are blocking me off. Remember you've told me about loving before. And then later you said I look like a grandmother. Me? I want to be sure this is not another lie. No. Well, yes. Benis does look like a grandmother. I'm sure your wife told you I appeared to you as Bernice twice. Well, yeah, she did, she did. Um, I, 
I would like to eat. Do you have food? Be my guest. I have everything you can ask for. Say whatever you want, and I'll give it to you. If I don't have it here, I'll go get it for you elsewhere. As long as I'm gotten in this country. Okay. Um. What about fried rice with chicken? Okay. Fried rice and chicken? Come in. longer shall you spend even one night in this small dingy field. The only man who has been chosen for me shall know no lack or poverty. Not while I have a lot to give him. And even more. Give me that picture. For what? Any B. No, just give it to me.
I'll just quickly pack up my things here. You want to be rich? Mm. Um, you are a witch. You're strong. You're rich. And you're in control of your life. I want to be a wizard. I want to be rich. I want to be strong. And be in control of my life. What do I have to do? But I love you the way you are. No complications. Except the ones given to you at birth. But where did you get all these powers from? My grandmother, she gave it to me. She gave me the egg I swallowed to become a member of the Coven. The same kind of egg that my stupid ex-wife swallowed. Yes, but hers is not as strong as mine. Mine is very, very intense. Well, I'm still happy. You've shown me love. You've given me joy. You've given me comfort. What else can I ask for? I can shop for you. I'll change your entire wardrobe. A fair to introduce you to my husband. The man I hold in my arm is my man. <laughs> Come, are you not hear me? Baby, please tell her. Tell her you love me and you want to marry me. Maybe she didn't hear me. <laughs> Very soon, my baby will be sold in my womb. And I'll shower both father and child with so much love. While you remain here, a mad imbecile, for trying to challenge me. Just give her the food. Can stand the smell. Yes. Eat it all. Eat it all up, including the food and the sand.
You know I'm a very good cook. Oh. No, you don't believe me. One of these days I'm going to cook for you. And I'm not going to cook pet man. Coco yam, mushroom, you know. <laughs> and the food will still be tasty. But wait, why won't you put those things? Um, pepe, coco yam, mushrooms. Because those things will take away your powers. Hmm? You know who you are. No, my dear. Those things don't weaken me. So what weakens you? Why do you ask? So that I don't mistakenly bring it into this house. I don't want to lose you. You know, I'm so used to you now. I've spent time with you. Yes, and you are shutting me out just one more time. What is in your mind today? Nothing. All right, go ahead and read my mind. Love is all I have. So, are you going to tell me or not? Come on, I live in this house with you. I sleep with you. I eat with you and I'm soon going to get married to you yet you don't trust me all right I'll just go away and think about my life because the woman I want to marry thinks that I'm going to kill her If it ever goes down my throat or touches my face, I'll be finished. Was that so difficult for you to say? I'm really falling for you, Chiki. Coven or no Coven. I'm just getting so used to you. I love you so much.
pleasure Only to give you pain If you sell your soul to the devil For power and gold One day you discover that There is no gain No gain No gain No gain, no gain. He will promise you pleasure Only to give you pain If you sell your soul to the devil For power and gold One day you discover that There is no gain So Run Don't take from the devil Run Don't give to the devil Run No matter what you give or take There is no gain No gain No gain No gain No gain He will promise you pleasure Only to give you pain If you sell your soul to the devil For power and gold Do you think I would let my wife rot just like that? You betray me! Temptation ah, comes shut. with many beautiful things. The devil takes more than he really gives. He will promise you power, he will promise to give you joy. But the devil only comes to kill and destroy. So run, don't take from the devil. Run, don't give to the devil. Run, no matter what you give or take, there is no gain. No gain, no gain, 
no game. No he will promise you pleasure, only oh, to give you pain. If you sell your soul to the devil for power and gold, one day you discover that there is no gain, no gain, no gain, no gain. No gain. He will promise you pleasure, only to give you pain. If you sell your soul to the devil for power and gold, one day you discover that there is no gain. No game. Temptation comes with many beautiful things. The devil takes more than he really gives. He will promise you power. He will promise to give you joy. But the devil only comes to kill and destroy. So run. Do you think I would have let you die? Or do you think I would have left you and settled for her? Hmm? No. I could hear everything. Everything that was happening to me, but I couldn't talk. It was like, it was like I was dead. rescued you from the mouth of death and I'm going to value you huh? you can wear whatever you want to or rub anything you want to rub on your lips Promise to give you joy, but the devil only comes to kill and destroy. So run, don't take from the devil. Run, don't give to the devil. Run, no matter what you give or take, there is no gain, no gain, no gain, no gain. No gain. No gain. He will promise you pleasure, only to give you pain. If you sell your soul to the devil for power and gold, one day you discover that there is no gain, no gain, no gain, no gain. No gain. No gain. No gain. He will promise you pleasure only to give you pain. If you sell your soul to the devil for power and gold, one day you discover that there is no gain. Sorry for her. It doesn't matter what I feel for her. She's in our business. Mm -hmm. Her business is with the cook. My yoga. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, ma. Ask her. Sir. What brings you here today? I passed through the mechanic workshop, the one repairing your car. So the car has started though. Mm. I don't know, I don't know if it is possible. So, uh, can I have my job back? So, I won't, I won't, I won't ever resign for such a flimsy excuse, sir. Please, sir. You can, you can have your job back. Can I? Oh, my God! Uh, you mean now? Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. God will bless you. Ah. Uh, God will bless you and bless you, Madam. God will bless you. 
God will bless you and your entire family. Hi! Wow, wow! You can imagine. Eh? I don't go with that. Good news. Say it. After my food. No. After my food. No. Tell me now, Discover that 